Hello and welcome to this week's uh, Trade of the Week on Monday, the 29th of January 2024. Last week, we wanted to go long the S&P 500 on a minor retracement. Now, unfortunately, we didn't see that retracement to the level we put our entry level at. And you can see here that we just continue to go higher. And uh, for those of you who did go long, you would have made a profit of about 70 points or so uh, since then. Now, what, what I find very really interesting is that a, a lot of... Um, uh, investors seem to be wanting to sell into the strength, saying, oh, it can't go any higher. It's trading at record highs and so forth. But don't forget, the trend is your friend. And also, over the last 13 weeks, the S&P 500 basically rallied on 12 of those 13 weeks. So even if a market does make new all-time record highs, it is more likely because of the momentum behind that move being positive for it to continue than for a reversal to be seen. Having said that, maybe this week we will see some a reversal like that because the remaining five of the magnificent seven stocks will be reporting uh, this week and that could let, lead to, to further volatility, either to the upside or downside. But uh, that brings me to this week's uh, trade of the week. And what I would like to do is actually go long the volatility index, the VIX. The reason for this is, as I've just said, um, the remaining uh, magnificent seven stocks in the US, uh, Alphabet, Amazon, Apple, Meta and Microsoft, all reporting this week, which could lead to volatility uh, in the S&P 500. And these stocks make up about 30 percent of it. So uh, basically a lot of volatility likely to be seen. That's what I would like to buy the VIX. And also we've got the monetary policy meetings by the Fed. Uh, the Federal Reserve in the US and also the Bank of England and on Friday non-farm payrolls. So uh, yes, that is our trade of the week to go long the VIX. So this week's trade of the week is to uh, go long the VIX index at around current levels around 1463 with a stop loss below the recent lows at around 1374 and an upside target of at least uh, 1686 where the 200 day simply moving average currently can be seen.